Young artist Maryam Kauseri's life took a drastic turn when the Taliban regained control of Afghanistan in August 2021. A 12th grade student at the time, she was barred from continuing her education, prompting her family to escape Afghanistan and migrate to Islamabad, Pakistan just six weeks after the Taliban takeover. I could no longer stay in Afghanistan because I could not continue drawing. If we had stayed, I would have forgotten everything that I knew because of the Taliban. Once I bought drawing supplies, and on my way home, they asked me, why do you do this? It is forbidden in Islam. Maryam's sister Khadija Kawsari is also an artist. She loves to paint and says it is the only thing that makes her happy. When I am sad or upset, I want to paint because using colors, such as green or red, brings positive energy. Because of their family's financial struggles, however, Maryam Kauseri and her four siblings are unable to afford school in Pakistan. The schools in Islamabad are very expensive and I cannot get an education because we do not have money. I want to earn money by painting so I can continue with my education. But Maryam Kauseri says painting equipment is expensive. We lost our hopes. We cannot achieve them. We are in a condition that we cannot think well. We are living in a poor economic situation. You must be in a good economic situation so you can work further on your painting skills and improve. According to the UN, 600,000 Afghans entered Pakistan after the Taliban took over Afghanistan. And most of those Afghans, including the Kausari family, face an uncertain future there. For Muska Safi in Islamabad, Pakistan, Bejan Hamdard, VOA News.